Cosmine strange Benuru bird was a cryptid reported from Egypt, a great heron that was used to represent the ancient Egyptian identity Benuru. It is sometimes thought to have been a giant or Beru heron, Adiria ben Nurudis, who is thought to have, been, have gone extinct around 1800 BC. However, there is some evidence such as an animal. So such an animal may have existed in Europe up until the ni- early 19th century. The Barura bird was depicted in ancient Egyptian art as an enormous heron, taller than a man with a pair of plumed feathers on its head and occasionally a shorter plume on its crest. Furthermore, it described by Ferreric period Egyptian documents. The Nile Delta was once home to a giant bird alleged to be a stork which lived in large flocks. Individuals of both sexes had white plumage, long tail feathers, and a long and straight bill, while the males were distinguished also by a tuft of feathers on the back of the head, and other on the beast. Sightings of giant stalk still existed in North Delta during the reign of Pharaoh Kuruvu, or Silipus, in the 26th century BC, where it's sometimes trapped by local peasants. 1820s, according to Egyptologist Joseph Bone Omari, sometime between 1821 and 1823, the Egyptologist James Burton had come across the three enormous colonial nests all within the space of a mile of the Egypt's Red Sea coast. <coughs> near a place called Jurel, Gedel, DZT, Tazu Gezel, Zatata. And nests were constructed out of sticks, weeds, fish bones, and so woven cloth at a watch. A human rib cage had a height of around 15 and then done fifteen it, diameter two point five to three. When Burton questioned locals about the nest, he was told they were made by enormous stalk like birds which used to live in the areas, but had disappeared shortly before Burton's arrival. Theories Archaeologist Ella Hooch of Copenhagen, Copenhagen University is noted for investigations of origin. Peruru bird. Initially, she theorized it was based on the grey heron, Adiri Sinari, but is that ready to reflect Peruru's significance? Alternatively, she suggested it might have been inspired by stories of the foreign Goliath heron, Adiri Goliath, which stands up to five feet tall and found in sub Saharan Africa, a tip of the Arabian Peninsula. A third primitive explanation was the purple heron, Adiri purpurea, which had a long black crest and was found throughout Africa and Middle East. During the 1970s, however, Hooch discovered the remains of an enormous heron material unearthed on the island of Umara and Anara in the United Arab Emirates, based on lower leg bone, initially discovered on the remains found later, established the heron could have been stood up to seven feet tall, with being band about of almost nine. Furthermore, various remains have been dated to 2600 BC to 2000 BC, around 18, 1800 BC. The period in which the Barua bird was being dis- illustrated, realizing the bird would have been the likeness model of the Barua bird, Hoach described it as the Aradaria Benadurus in 1977. Carl Schuker also notes that the description of Neil Delta's giant stalk was actually more representative of a heron compared particularly well with the description of the Barua bird, leading him to query whether the alleged stalk was in fact Enduro Benadunus.